to this jet power longboard. I'm pretty sure it's like a skateboard that's powered by a jet. So let's check it out. Somebody probably trying to build it. So let's see what it do. All right, so we're working hard on the Ironman flight project. And as you know, since I'm visiting Colin Furs in September, we decided to make a little gadget for a little fun test with his 360 swing. We're making a jet belt, and we're gonna hopefully ride the swing and go all the way around. Take a look. All right, so we've completed the, uh, I don't know what we want to call it, the turbine belt. Jet belt. <laughs> Jet belt. And uh, Ian's going to put it on. We're going to do some current measurements to see how much these EDFs are drawing. Uh, these particular ones are supposed to draw about six kilowatts each, so we'll be able to see um, what one's doing. So uh, first test with the rocket belt, we're going to be using a bike and see how fast we can get. Well, it's not powered by the power by the jet pack. Mm. I did not know how to ride. Is that your invention or what? Uh, yeah, we run a YouTube channel yeah. and we just build crazy engineering stuff. Yeah. It's actually the beginning of a bigger project where we're going to attempt to fly. Like a jet pack. What? Yeah. So I just got an email from Colin. Turns out he's taken the swing down already because apparently his neighbors complained. He's not gonna try that. Oh man, I gotta see this. I was really looking forward to trying it using the jet belt, but we can still have some fun with this thing. Take a look. Big shout out to Hobby King for supplying all the components we needed to build this project. Hobby King is a leading supplier of the best RC parts and components at some of the lowest prices. You should check them out. There's a link in the description. On your marks, get 
set. Oh, they gonna race Go. too? Oh, you got a head start on. Oh, he catching up. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wipeout. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, I that crash could have been a lot worse. Uh, lithium polymer batteries like to explode, and if anything punctured them or caused them to rupture, it would have been bad. Take a look at this clip to see what could have happened. Woo. Anyways, Whoa. the moral of the story is if you've never longboarded before, you probably shouldn't strap 12 kilowatts of electric ducted fans to yourself and expect a good result. That being said, we didn't damage the motors, so we're going to be doing a lot more fun tests in the future as we continue to evolve this project into the Iron Man Flight Project. Thanks for watching. Check it out. Iron Man Flight Project. I got to show this to my son. I think he'll like it. But I like to do that too. Oh, what's that? Oh yeah, my son would love this. Oh yeah, I gotta show my son this. So, hope you like the video. If you do, subscribe, comment down below. All right.